September has drawn to a close after a fantastic month. Bitcoin is gaining traction like never before. With more and more countries encouraging Bitcoin growth, top growing cryptocurrencies are attracting investors. After a difficult August, the month of September started off well. Bitcoin and Ethereum are both increasing in popularity. Apart from these two, though, several other cryptocurrencies are gaining popularity as well. Let's look at the cryptocurrencies that saw the most growth in September. But first, hello and welcome back to the channel. Monero will be the first coin on this list. XMR Monero is a safe, anonymous, and untraceable cryptocurrency. This open-source cryptocurrency was first released in April 2014, and it quickly gained popularity among cryptography aficionados. The development of this coin is entirely funded by donations and driven by the community. Monero was created with a heavy focus on decentralization and scalability, and it uses a technology called ring signatures to provide perfect secrecy. With this method, a group of cryptographic signatures appears, at least one of which is genuine, but the genuine one cannot be identified because they all appear authentic. Monero has gained an unsavory reputation due to its extraordinary security systems, and it has been tied to illicit enterprises all over the world. While Monero is a good candidate for anonymous illicit transactions, the secrecy it provides is also beneficial to dissidents in authoritarian countries around the world. Monero has a market capitalization of $245 million and a per token value of $265 as of September 2021. Then there's Tether, USDT. Tether was one of the first and most popular of a class of cryptocurrencies known as stablecoins, which tried to decrease volatility by pegging their market value to a currency or other external reference point. Tether and other stablecoins seek to smooth out price variations to attract consumers who might otherwise be wary of digital currencies, especially significant ones like Bitcoin, which have suffered repeated bouts of severe volatility. The price of Tether is directly linked to the price of the US dollar. The method enables users to make transfers from other cryptocurrencies to US dollars in a fraction of the time it takes to convert to regular currency. Tether is the fifth largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization as of September 20. 2021, with a total market capitalization of $68 billion and $3 million and a per token value of $1. Binance One is another coin to keep an eye on, BNB. Binance Coin is a utility cryptocurrency that may be used to pay for trading costs on the Binance Exchange. Those that use the token to pay for the exchange can trade at a reduced rate. Binance Coin's blockchain also serves as the foundation for Binance's decentralized exchange. Changpeng Zhao launched the Binance Exchange, which is one of the most popular in the world in terms of trading volume. Binance Coin was first released as an ERC-20 token on the Ethereum platform. It was subsequently given its mainnet. The network uses a proof-of-stake consensus model. Binance Coin's market capitalization is $71 billion as of September 2021, with one BNB worth $426. Keep an eye on this new Chainlink as well, L-I-N-K. Chainlink is a decentralized oracle network that connects smart contracts, such as those on Ethereum, to data outside the platform. Blockchains can't securely link to external apps. Smart contracts can communicate with outside data using Chainlink's decentralized oracles, executing them based on data that Ethereum cannot access. Several use cases for Chainlink systems are detailed on the company's blog. One of the numerous applications described is monitoring water supplies for pollution or illegal siphoning in certain cities. Sensors might be installed to track corporate consumption, water tables, and local water levels. This data may be tracked by a Chainlink oracle and fed straight into to a smart contract. With the incoming data from the Oracle, the smart contract might be set up to issue fines, issue flood warnings to cities, or invoice corporations using too much of a city's water. Sergey Nazarov and Steve Ellis collaborated on Chainlink. Chainlink has a market capitalization of $13 billion and $5 million as of September 2021, and one link is worth $30.50. Next up on the list is Stellar XLM. 
Stellar is an open blockchain network that connects financial institutions for massive transactions to give enterprise solutions. Huge transactions between banks and investment firms, which used to take several days, involve some intermediaries and cost a lot of money, may now be completed almost instantly with no intermediaries and for a fraction of the cost. Jed McCaleb, a founding member of Ripple Labs and the creator of the Ripple Protocol, launched Stellar. He subsequently left Ripple and went on to form the Stellar Development Foundation with his co-founders. As of September 2021, Stellar Lumens have a market capitalization of $565 million and are valued at 33 cents. Good day, mates. We've made it halfway through our list, and we sincerely hope you've enjoyed it thus far. If you have, please give us a thumbs up and turn on notifications to be notified of new uploads. Returning to the list is Bitcoin Cash, BCH because it is one of the earliest and most successful hard forks of the original Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, BCH, occupies a significant place in the history of altcoins. A split occurs in the Bitcoin sector as a result of disagreements and debates between developers and miners. Because of the decentralized nature of digital currencies, substantial changes to the code underpinning the token or coin in question require widespread consensus. The mechanism for this process varies with every cryptocurrency. When rival groups cannot agree, the digital currency is divided. However, the original chain remains true to its original code, and the new chain starting as a new version of the previous coin, replete with code revisions. BCH has a market capitalization of roughly $12 billion and a value per token of $640 as of September 2021. Polkadot comes next, DOT. Polkadot is a one-of-a-kind proof-of-stake coin that aims to provide interoperability between different blockchains. Its protocol connects permission and permissionless blockchains and oracles, allowing systems to collaborate under one roof. Polkadot's essential component is its relay chain, which enables network interoperability. It also allows for parachains or alternative blockchains with their native currency for specific use scenarios. Polkadot differs from Ethereum in that instead of constructing just decentralized applications on the platform, developers can establish their blockchain while still benefiting from the security provided by Polkadot's chain. Developers can establish new blockchains with Ethereum, but they must implement their security mechanisms, exposing new and smaller projects to attack. As the larger a blockchain is, the more secure it is. Polkadot refers to this concept as shared security. Polkadot has a market capitalization of around $35 billion as of September 2021, and one dot is worth $35.25. Cardano ADA is, of course, on our list. Cardano is an Ouroboros proof-of-stake cryptocurrency developed by engineers, mathematicians, and cryptography professionals using a research-based approach. Charles Hoskinson, one of Ethereum's five original founding members, was a co-founder of the project. However, after some differences with Ethereum's direction, he quit and later assisted in creating Cardano. Cardano's blockchain was developed through considerable testing and peer-reviewed research by the Cardano team. The project's researchers have authored over 90 papers on blockchain technology covering a wide range of issues. Cardano's research is its foundation. Cardano has the third largest market value of $71 billion as of September 2021, and one ADA is worth roughly $2.25. We also have Litecoin, LTC. Litecoin, which debuted in 2011, was one of the first cryptocurrencies to follow in Bitcoin's footsteps and has been dubbed the silver to Bitcoin's gold. Charlie Lee, a former Google engineer and MIT graduate, designed it. Litecoin has a market capitalization of $4 billion and a per-token value of roughly $199 as of September 2021, making it the world's 16th largest cryptocurrency. And we'll wrap out this list with a bang by introducing you to the top of the heap, Ethereum, ETH. Ethereum, the first Bitcoin alternative on our list, is a decentralized software platform that allows smart contracts and decentralized applications, dApps, to be written and run without the need for third-party downtime, fraud, control, or intervention. Ethereum's goal is to establish a decentralized suite of financial goods that anybody in the world, regardless of nationality, ethnicity, or beliefs, can freely access. This element heightens the ramifications for some countries, as those without access to governmental infrastructure 
infrastructure and identity can obtain bank accounts, loans, insurance, and many other financial items. Ethereum applications are powered by Ether, the platform's proprietary cryptographic token. Ether serves as a mode of transportation on the Ethereum network. It is mostly sought by developers who want to build and run apps and investors who want to buy other digital currencies with Ether. Ether, which was founded in 2015, is the second largest digital currency by market value behind Bitcoin. However, it is still a long way behind the dominating cryptocurrency. Ether's market valuation is nearly half of that of Bitcoin, trading at around $3,600 per ETH as of September 2021. That concludes today's video. Please subscribe to the channel and enable alerts to be notified of new uploads.